So Joe Jackson signed the Neutrons right. to Jackson Records. Yes, sir. Now, but the Jackson 5 and all them, they were signed to Motown. Yeah. No, no, they were gone then. Oh, they were gone by then. Yeah, they was gone to okay, CBS. Okay, and Michael Jackson had his deal with, uh, with who? CBS. They had CBS. They had deal with CBS. Yeah. Okay, so, yeah. so Jackson Records was something that Joe Jackson, that was his own Michael project. had put his money with it. It was Jackson sure. family money, Captain, everybody's money. Okay. So, so you now Cause signed... Because at that time, Joe had Janis Jackson and Latoya. Janis Jackson. It was on and, the and Latoya. Oh, yeah, they, they, they were on Jackson Records. Yeah, they were on Jackson Records. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. So now you're assigned to Joe Jackson. Right. And we, and I managed him with him because we cousins. We found out we was cousins from Pine Bluff, Arkansas. So he said, "Okay, we cousins. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna split the management with you, and pay you, and make sure you guys is all right." Okay. And what was it like doing business with Joe Jackson? I love Joe Jackson, to death. To death. Joe Jackson gave me yeah. He's not the mean guy that everybody say he is. He had to be hard on his boys because he didn't want them to get in trouble. My situation was different. I was a gangster. Joe was a working man. I was a male. So it was a difference. I didn't really believe in abusing my kids because, hoping on my kids because um, um, I uh, was abused by myself. But I was pretty rough on my kids too. I mean, you know, I did some crazy stuff to my kids. Like, like he threw his, like Terrence Howard threw his kids in the, in the trunk. I threw my boys in the trunk, the two Ronnies, because some, something came up missing and they were supposed to be watching it. So I got mad while they was rehearsing at the ranch. We had a ranch with horses and I uh, threw them in the trunk. And uh, shout out to Trump, over the Trump, not in the Trump, but over the Trump. Had them kicking and scared to death. But when they came out the Trump, they were soldiers after that. Right. So, so now the Neutrons is signed to Jackson Records. Right. And did you start to meet Michael Jackson during this I time? I met Michael Jackson at that time. Uh, we did a show at the Roxy for Jackson Records. And uh, Michael went, came in, Michael, Latoya, and Janice all came, which is in my book. I write it probably in my book. And Michael saw my kids and went crazy, said, and taped him. Matter of fact, he has a tape of the Roxy show where he taped it. And he said, then, um, that was the night of my wife's uh, birthday, and we were staying at the Sunset uh, Hotel on Sunset. And um, that morning after doing the show, Michael call, had Joe call and invite us over for breakfast. And we stayed over there almost a day and a half. And we spent the night over there. And uh, after that, I started visiting the ranch, ranch frequently, talking to Mike, hanging out with Mike, and all Th this, this stuff. This is a uh, Neverland Ranch, right? Neverland. No, no. This is Abraham's land. This okay. when everybody was thousands of people outside the door, and nobody okay. could get in but people that had, was on the list. Bill Bray was security then. Okay. And I'll never forget it because I used to tell my kids one day we're gonna get to the Jacksons, right? And we used to go on a yellow bus and sit out in the front, and never could get in, right? And my kids were like, Dad, let's go home. I want to go home. Because I had moved them to Granada Hills, too. Mm -hmm. And they said, I want to go home. I said, so I said, let me get off the bus. And I pulled a, bu a bunch of flowers from Joe Jackson's front yard. And I said, I'm going to pray on these flowers, right? And the next thing I know, we went down to uh, uh, the Jackson's house. And my kids say, Dad, is this real? I said, watch this. I said, they said, who might say it's calling? I said, the neutrons and the black gate going. I looked at joyful look on my kids' eyes. They were like amazed. That was the greatest thing they ever did for them in their life. That was better than money. They was going to see the greatest that ever did it. Michael Jackson, the king of pop. My yep. kids were like, oh, dad, you pulled it off. Oh, dad, we love you. And then Michael came out and they hugged him and they all ran around that, uh, uh, Encino Ranch and just having fun playing with Louis the Lamb. And, uh, 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 the, uh, the, 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 he had a great big old snake, and I don't know if his name was Joe, but it was, I think it was Joe. But I'm not sure. Yeah, the snake named Joe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He had a big old uh, uh, okay. what they call that snake? Uh, anaconda. Uh, almost like an anaconda, right? Right. About 50 feet long. And I said, "What's the snake name?" I think he said Joe. I said, "Joe." And he said, "Yeah." I said, "Oh, okay." And so he and Louis the Lamb spit at me, right? He like to. There was one of the things I like to spit at. You know that we know what I'm talking about, right? Yeah. He spit all the time. And so he had bubbles, and I never forget the kids was playing with bubbles. So Bubba bit Jay. Bubbles is the monkey. Is the monkey? Bubba bit Jay on his arm, and Jay said, "Dad, he bit me." Michael said, "He did what?" He said, "Bubba, did you bite him?" He said, "Michael said." Bam! Slapped him to his knees. And Bubba said, I said, what is he doing? Michael said, praying for his life. Because he know he didn't did the wrong thing. So, so Michael Jackson beat up Bubbles. Hit him with an eight-piece. With an eight-piece. With an eight-piece. <laughs> Michael was fast. 
Really? Oh, my God. So, mon monkeys are really strong, though. Yeah, but he couldn't mess with Mike. Mike hit him so fast, man, he was down on his knees. So, so Friends. So Mike just life. beat the crap out of Bubbles. He hit him with an eight-piece. Hit him with an eight-piece. Like piece. Mayweather hit Pacquiao. Okay. Now, later on, Michael was being charged with the whole child molestation thing. Mm -hmm. And you actually got dragged into this. Uh, yeah, a friend of mine proceedings. told National Inquiry that he knew some family that knew the Jacksons. And they called me on the phone and asked me to come to the hotel. Now, me being a player from the Himalayas, I said, I'm going to go and see what they're talking about. So I could take the information back to Mike and Johnny Cochran. So I go down and I say, yeah, what's happening? So they say, yeah, well, I said, well, they said, I said, what I'm here for? I said, I'm, I said, I'm here to help Michael. Oh, he said, oh, no. We don't, that ain't what we want with you. We heard it, that, that your boy spent nights at the house. We want to know if Michael tampered with him. I just picked him up or touched him in any kind of way. If he did, we got 200000 for you. I said, huh? I had just got out of prison. I said, man, I can't do that. Can't tell no lie like that. I ain't doing that. He said, you show what I'm, I'm, I'm going to do. I'm going to draw a check up, a contract up, and I'm going to show you we're going to give you 200000 so they want to pay you 200000 to say that Michael Jackson molested touched, your kids. Yeah, t just touched him or whatever, man. Right. That's the anything. Well, well, what would you have done if you found out that Michael Jackson molested your kids? What you think I would have done, man? I'm a, I'm a gangster. Come on, man. Right. It would have been a problem. Come on. Right. You well, you, you, told, you told me back when we met up years ago that if that would have happened, you would have killed Michael Jackson. If he had touched my kids? Yeah. Absolutely. Right. Yeah. But I love Mike, and I know Mike didn't do that, so he didn't have no problem worrying, worrying about me. Exactly. Right. So, so, but, but, and I remember you had shown me a picture a while back. Right. It, it was your son at Michael Jackson's house wearing his underwear, and but that was a personal picture that you no, took. I took that picture. They just got out of the swimming pool. Yeah. I exactly. took that picture. But Michael, they wanted to use that picture yeah, as evidence against Michael Jackson. Right, right, right. Yes, they did. Yeah. Okay, but you weren't go, going for it. for that now. Okay. And Michael Jackson ended up winning the case. Yes. And when I was, matter of fact, I was on my way down to help him win the case when I got a phone call from Messner and said, oh, we don't need you. Mike gonna, Mike gonna be all right. I said, okay. So, Ron, what is this a picture of right here? I'm, uh, I got the glove on, Michael Jackson's famous glove. It's worth 250000 And I got the driller jacket in my hand, and I got one of the silver jackets on. I got the silver glove on. Oh. So Mike, so Mike will let me put it all on. Mike okay. will put the coat on me himself. So that's Michael Jackson's coat his glove, and his thriller jacket. Yes, it is. What is this right here? Oh, that's me and Joe Jackson when, in uh, the Encino bedroom talking, hanging out. That's Joe Jackson on the bed right, right there. Yeah, that's when I had uh, took a, skipped away from Susanville. <laughs> <laughs> You're on vacation. I was on vacation. That's Michael Jackson's, uh, uh, where the platinum albums are all kept in that room, the, uh, the Mayor Billiard room of the Michael Jackson and the Jackson Five. That's downstairs in the big room with the platinum records. Okay, and those are your kids in Neutrons? That's, that's the kids in Neutrons. Now this one is Michael Jackson. I think I'm the only person he ever called Dad, because he called Joe Joseph. He said, to Dad. You see the signature? Yeah. To Daddy, Ron New. This is my wife and my kids. We're up in the Michael Jackson's uh, room where he had got his costumes at. What is this right here? That's Michael Jackson's jacket when he went on the tour, when he was touring. This is the Jacksons. Yeah, this is the Jacksons. Okay, this is why he was still the with Pepsi them. when he did the Pepsi commercial. Okay, was he still with the Jackson Five during this time or no? Yeah, looked like a burn mark guy. Yeah. Wait, was this the actual jacket he yeah, was wearing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, this guess is the jacket he was I wearing. I got this out of his closet. <laughs> so you think this is the jacket that he actually? I'm not sure. I know there's a burn mark on it when I took it out. Right, because when he was doing the Pepsi commercial. His, his Jerry Curl, Curl yeah, fire. Yeah, 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 but I don't know if he had the jacket on or what. I don't know, but I know this, I got this out of Michael's closet. That's Michael Jackson and Jackie Jackson and his Michael's bodyguard over behind Bobby with Michael arm around Bobby. Jay's standing in front of Michael. Ronnie's holding bubbles. Channel Law's in the back. Jackie's right there. Misha's right there. Ron, Ron is right there. And Ronnie, that's the day that Bubbles bit Jay on the arm. Okay, so there's Bubbles the monkey right there. There's Bubbles the there. monkey right there. That's the same monkey that. That's the same monkey that Michael was carrying around. So, Valentine. so, Bubbles bit who? Jay, or the baby, Jay. Jay Valentine. Okay, he bit Jay, mm -hmm. and then Michael beat the Hit shit. him with an eight piece, yeah. Hit him with an eight piece. Michael hit him with an eight piece. That's Bubble. We're in the yard, Michael Jackson's yard at the Encino house on Amon Hurst. That's Ron, Bob, Newt holding Bubbles. Misha 
watching Bob hold Bubbles and the bodyguard. Right, and that's and your it's daughter. Ronnie over in the corner. Right. That's and my that, daughter Misha, yeah. That's your daughter Misha holding Bubbles right, right, right there. Right, right. Okay. And this is where, this right here when we were on Jackson Records. Mike on his knees, please. Joe Jackson over in the counter looking at Michael. Got his eye on, on, on Mike. We got, got that snake eye on. Uh, eyes on the prize. Eye on the prize. I had Michael Jackson and him on my visiting list in federal penitentiary. Michael Jackson's on your visiting list? Yes, right so, there. So Michael Jackson came and visited you in prison? I ain't gonna say. <laughs> but he was on the Would you see his name? Where's Mike at? Yeah, yeah. Michael Jackson, Joe Jackson approved visiting for Terminal Island, California. Him kind of crying and me crying, so you know what I mean? It's just, there was no more to worry. A couple of days later, they tell me he died. How did you feel when they, when um, they said that? I mean, did you know that he was gonna die? With it, when nah, you saw the tubes? No? No, no, no. Uh uh, give me a second. Though. To go through all you went through and your end result is being killed in a drive-by, affiliation is like, is like way beyond the aspect of, of, of because you could have been here and left a, a way better mark.